Hello, sports fans. This is Stephen Hill for Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special interview. I'm going to be covering the tennis phenom, Tahid Browning, and his rise in up the tennis rankings in the United States. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure you go ahead and subscribe right now so you can get all the updates with Sports Choice Plus when we do interviews, breakdown of NFL, NBA, and all of our coverage of sports. Uh, without further ado, we're going to get right into the action. I have one of the hottest phenoms in high school coming up the tennis ranks right now. And, you know, Mr. Browning, how did you get your start in tennis? I got started by uh, my dad playing, and he was a coach, and he coached my sister. This park called Shimoda in Philadelphia, and I was always around them while they trained, and I didn't really like it because I thought tennis was dumb. And the more, the more and more I was around it, the more I started to pick it up and like it. Okay, so rather than playing basketball, rather than playing football, or another sport, what made you fall in love with tennis? Uh, I think one of the reasons just because how much I was around it and then how much my sister played and my dad was coaching my sister. So from a young age, you picked up some of the skill sets and you became talented. What does it mean to you to be one of the hottest ranked high school players going into this year's tennis season? It means a lot because you definitely turn a lot ahead and getting more opportunities than some other players that don't get the looks that you might get. So I, I learned over this past weekend that going to one of your tournaments locally uh, that you have a water company. Folks, I've tasted it for myself. Uh, this is good water. I'm going to leave the description in the description box below. Uh, tell me a little bit about your water and, and the luxury lifestyle as far as your water goes. Uh, I they're t we're trying to get to like Fiji and uh, Voss, so it's mo mostly a lu luxury water and high-end water. So we're trying to get into like stores, markets, and it's great tasting water for sure. All right. Do you have any message for any young person, whether it be male or female, that's coming up in the inner cities that possibly doesn't have access to tennis right now, that just plays basketball or football or, or a different sport? Uh, one message I definitely have for male and female is that we, if more players play tennis, we most likely take over because just how athletic we are and just the ability that we're given. If it's one favorite tennis player you have, who would be your go-to tennis player, male or female? Uh, Nick Kyrgios. Why is that? Because he reminds me, he has style, he's also talented, and he's also a funny person. And it's, it's super good at tennis. All right, folks. Um, I want to thank you for your time, Mr. Browning. Thank you. Uh, folks, make sure you cover this guy. I want you to definitely check out. I'm going to leave his links to his social media. I'm going to leave his links to the water company. And I'm also going to leave you his links to this interview so you can share it in your sports group. We want to make sure you're subscribing and checking out Mr. Tahid Browning as he rises up. And, folks, you're seeing it here. I'm telling you now. In a couple of years, this guy is going to be on the top of every single tennis tournament in the country. We're talking professionals as well. So I want to thank y'all so very much for definitely checking this out. Make sure you're sharing this in your sports groups on Facebook. And make sure you're tweeting this on your Twitter, your Instagram, putting it everywhere. We want everyone to see this young, phenomenal kid. And I thank you as always. Until next time, folks, we'll see you soon.